Hi all, welcome back. In the previous video, we discussed about why GCP and the importance of GCP in the next 10 to 15 years and how this particular Google Cloud platform is different from the other cloud services like AWS and Azure. So in this video, let us try to get started with some learning GCP. So first of all, in order to get started with GCP, log in to cloud.com google.com slash free okay so here what you can see is uh, you can see um, various information about the google cloud uh, services there are 20 plus free products which are av available for free for all the customers and uh, also google provides you with dollar 300 in free credits for new customers so with this amount you can try to explore the different services which are available in google cloud platform okay and you won't be charged until you upgrade to your uh, upgrade your uh, subscription okay so let us try to get started by clicking on get started for free so here if you see uh, it is access to all cloud platform products so you get everything you need to build and run your apps websites and services including all these firebases and google map api okay and you get dollar 300 credit for free and no auto charge after the free trial end. So you want to provide your credit card information, but it will not be auto charged after this particular trial period ends. Okay. So unless you manually upgrade to a paid account, it will not be charged. First, you provide your Gmail um, account in which you want to continue this service. So I want to continue with this Conquer Data Science itself. So I'm leaving as it is. If not, I can give switch account and change to any other account. And um, you can select the country. And what describes your organizations or need so this is actually i am subscribing to this service just for my personal project or um, career aspirations so you can select based upon these or if it is a class uh, assignment or any other also you can select it so for now i'm selecting personal project and i'm accepting to the terms and services and clicking on continue so this is for the identity verification and contact information so they'll be sending you the six digit code to verify our identity so here i can provide my phone number like this uh, 9876 like that okay and when you give click on send code you'll be sending you'll be receiving a code and you can use that code for verifying your identification using your contact number okay so once the verification is done you'll be uh, pointed to this particular payment information uh, verification section so here I can give business name as, um, okay, I'm just giving my business name as Conquer Data Science and uh, card details. So I gave all my card details and uh, my address, it asked for my address and things. All those details are entered. I'm just clicking on start my free trial. So it is actually setting up the billing. Card is successfully added and um, and this brought me to this particular welcome page. This page tells you like the free trial includes uh, 300 in credit and it can be spent over the next 90 days. Okay. Uh, there are also some additional questions. What best describes your organization or need or what brought you? So I just wanted to learn and explore more. So I'm directly going with that option. Learn and explore more. Click on next. What are you interested in doing with Google Cloud? My interest would be um, machine learning and AI and then... Um, data analytics yeah and whichever whichever is your interest matrix you can click on that and click on next what best describes your role so i'm just selecting my role it is data scientist or data engineer and then clicking on done okay okay so there are also the, uh, you can see like there are um, free tutorials for compute engine cloud storage and cloud sql okay if you want to continue here you can continue with this free tutorials and monthly it's estimate also they have provided 5.10 credits also it is also mentioned and it is 25.46 credits okay if you want to continue you can continue here if not you can just click on skip for now so this is how the google cloud platform looks like so here you have various services like apis billing iam marketplace compute engine and things like that in the next few videos we will try to understand each of these better and try to uh, learn google cloud platform in a much better way okay thanks for watching have a nice day